Hi, CLA kids. For those of you who don't know me, my name is Miss Anna, and I am one of the Sparky's teachers at um, Wednesday nights um, at CLA. And I just wanted to really quickly get online and to say hi and to say that I miss you guys and that I love you and that I'm really sad I can't see all my Sparkies in person. Um, but I wanted to just really uh, quickly share a video with you guys. Um, I talked to Miss Donnell from the Cubbies class and I also talked to Commander Wes. We wanted to remind you guys that even though it's kind of an uncertain time and that it can maybe even seem a little scary scary right now that um, you guys have been prepared for such a time as this and that you are not alone that um, we're all in this together and um, best of all God has promised to never leave us or forsake us and um, we've all been prepared to walk through anything um, we talked about Esther in our last Sparky's class and um, Esther was living during a really uncertain time and there was a really bad guy that wanted to kill her people. He didn't know that Esther was a Jew and um, God put her in a position to be the new queen over this huge land and God used her during that time um, to save all of her people and to turn everyone around so they started to worship God. Um, we talked about Esther in our Sparky's class and Miss Donnell told me that the Cubbies have been learning all about Noah and how God prepared Noah for his time um, when when the land went, or when he was um, building his ark, he was surrounded by people that thought he was crazy. Um, they made fun of him. They laughed at him. They said, what are you building this huge boat for? You are crazy. It's not raining. There's never going to be a flood that covers the whole earth. And that's just what happened. And during that time, um, God was faithful to Noah and Noah learned to listen to God and to only hear his voice. Do you want to come say hi, Vivi? Can you come say hi to Miss Donnell? Hi, Miss Donnell. Vivian is wearing her backwards outfit. You want to sit with me? So we just wanted to remind you guys that um, God has prepared you for such a time as this. And for such a time as this. That's right, lady. Um, and so I just want you guys to remember that God's promises are for you. They're not against you. They, yes, that God's promises are for you. They're not against you, that he has promised you all good things, no evil things and no bad dreams. That's right, Vivi. He loves each and every one of you. And um, if you can, shh, shh, shh. okay, just a sec. If you can, I want you to kind of come up with some ways that God has prepared you. Um, I know in our Sparky's class, we have a time called soak time every night. And that is a time where we try to be quiet, we try to be still, and we try to listen um, and to hear God's voice. Um, one of the, some of the things that we do during that time is we get out our journals, we listen to some of our favorite worship music, and we can get into our Bibles. No more talking, just a second. Let's finish the video. Okay. Okay. So I want to encourage you guys even though you um, aren't together with us at church doing soak time to um, wherever you're at, at home, in your room or in your kitchens, to get out your journals and um, to have a soak time all on your own. Because um, one thing I know for certain, wherever we are, God loves spending time with you. Isn't that right, Vivian? Do you like to talk to God? Yeah. So remember that God has pre prepared you for such a time as this. What is inside of this? Um, in talking to Commander Wes, he reminded me that the Rangers motto kind of is just that. The Rangers motto is ready. Be ready for anything. Let me read it here. Ready to work, ready to play, ready to serve, ready to worship ready to live and obey God's word. So even though right now, 
even though we may want to be together, maybe some of us don't understand why we can't be together. Um, remember that God has prepared you and that we can be ready for anything um, with God by our side. Um, so that's all I have for you guys today. Um, again, we love you and we miss you and we can't wait to see you. What do you want to say? Say bye-bye. Bye. -bye. bye. Love you. Love you, CLA kids. Talk to you soon.